Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Realistic Gaming Man, and today we are here on Percy and the Beast Productions channel because I did ask you guys last week on the video, on the Soldier Fallout video, if you guys wanted me to react to his videos, and you guys said, of course. So here we are today. We find ourselves on this lovely channel. Go check him out, subscribe to him. Shout out to Percy Man for these awesome videos. And not only Percy, um, shout out to Timothy Thunderbolt for creating this awesome Soldier Fallout series. And I also believe Percy and the Beast Productions did create his own spin-off, which is the Nightmare Begins Soldier Dark Realm. So if you guys want me to check out his creation on Soldier Fallout, let me know in the comments down below. Alright, well with that being said, we're going to be reacting to his video, which is, I did tell you guys, he did have about 7 videos into Soldier Fallout. So we're going to go back to square one, and we're going to start off with... <laughs> Yes. Which is where it all started. So let's go ahead and react to this video and let's begin. Ooh, back to square one, man. I mean, it's good, right? We can refresh our memory. Oh, the sign was like, was oh, there it is. Look, is that James. Oh man. Boy, zooming. Henry? Oh no, that's a duck. Percy and the Beast Productions presents Soda Fallout, originally by created by Timothy Thunderbolt. Soda Fallout, episode one, the Brendan Babe last. Dude, this feels like I'm watching a movie. Like some Star Wars or something. Here we go. I've had this journal for March 5th, 1973. Time. And at first, when my wife got it, it became more of a paperweight than anything else. But I decided to bring it out now since there seems to be something going on here. Hey, Don James there. Recently, Tuffin signed an agreement for this new nuclear power plant the government is building on the Brendan branch between the docks and Suddery. Of all the places they could have put it, they had to put it near the most beautiful line, in my opinion. Okay, so this is very detailed, which is pretty good. That's going to affect tourism, and that's probably why the big man signed that contract to take nuclear waste to from the mainland. He's got to regain that money somehow anyways, besides that nothing's changed. Okay, I see that. What else? Edward's doing fine, and he's got a similar opinion to me on the power plant. He said it's going to be an eyesore, but he does like the idea of doing more work. Oh man, it seems like they're going to be fairly busy after this. Once it opens. So, Thomas. I'm writing this while we wait for the all clear of the platform. So I'll keep this book in the cab if we spot anything else going on. Okay, so whose perspective are we hearing this from? Or seeing this? Oh, July 4th, 1973, 2.34 p.m. Oh, here God comes a big it. day. I knew this would happen. The power plant exploded. We were at Wellsworth when it happened. We heard a loud explode. The sky went red. And this huge cloud was visible in the distance. Sydney and I knew exactly where that came from. And we knew that we had to leave. Grabbing them like that, my boy, kind of sus. And there it is, the Brendan Baby Blast, ladies and gentlemen. Hold on to your seats because we will get hit with the with the blast wave. People cleared the platform faster than I have ever there seen. There goes that word. We knew the shockwave would be coming fast, so we didn't even wait for an all clear. We released the brakes, hit the regulator, and pulled on the whistle for dear life, hoping that Cedric was still in the signal box to set the point. Was that the blast? 
Thank was. God he was, because without him, we would have been killed. We sped down the line at speeds we've never gone before. Donald, who was heading the opposite way, pulling so good, we found out later that he didn't make it out alive. Neither did William or Colin in his head. That is so sad, man. Rip to all those. I like this one. They're more detailed. Edward was probably the most horrified out of all of us. I don't blame him. While we all have some layer of protection, he didn't, so that probably motivated him to go faster. Yeah, man, I would be terrified too. Don't you see that boy zooming out there? He does have people on the cabs. We shot past Crossley, and that's when the shockwave hit us, and it was strong. It caused the glass and the coaches to shatter and rock them side to side. Edward broke only truck off the derail of the pole because of it, but those things didn't stop us. We could feel the heat rise, but it didn't stop until we got to Memphis. Alright, so it seems like they suffered a bit from the shockwave, but nothing too, uh... Nothing too deadly. As it seems like they made it back. Good evening, I'm Dr. Stuart Bailey. I work for the Atomic Energy Authority. I've worked for the AEE for 10 years, three of which I spent at AEE Winfrith near Dorset. I'm joined by my colleagues, Dr. Middleton and Dr. Dalby, both of which are my junior. At about 2.30 this afternoon, that's July 4th, the power station at Lower Brendam suffered a widespread system failure of four reactors online. Dang. Only one is currently operating. The plant is currently running on backup power with staff attempting to remedy the problem. The amount of radiation vented, or if radiation has been vented at all, is currently unknown. Thanks. Teams from the Atomic Energy Authority have been dispatched to Lower Brendam to take radiation readings. We urge the citizens of Western Sodor to stay in their homes until the state of emergency is lifted or an order to evacuate is given. Uh, thank you. So I guess they're mutating as they were speaking. As we've seen. Created by Percy and the Beast Productions. Dude, this was sick. Shout out to Percy and the Beast Productions, man. Not copyrighted. Rip. All right, and then we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Dude, that's a cool PFP, man. We got the beast on there. All right, well, episode two is already out. Episode two is already out. As I said, he does have seven more episodes. If you guys want me to continue off the series, let me know in the comments down below. And I also love his videos more because they do give off a little bit more of a detail than the rest of the other videos that are created on sort of fallout which is amazing all right you guys well that was sort of fallout the brandon bay blast if you guys enjoyed the video you know what to do man smash the like button subscribe turn that notification bell on and all that good stuff and i will catch you all in the next one perfect